Hi, it's Russ from Studio One Expert, and in this video, I'm going to kind of continue on from the last video, if you haven't watched that, which was a kind of primer on some of the cool things you could do with chord track. Uh, now, one feature that Doors have had for years, and Studio One has it as well, is as you play into uh, from a, an instrument into the instrument tracks, uh, some will call them MIDI tracks, is that you will be able to quantize the notes as you're playing them. So when you finish playing, it will push and pull them to the nearest value that you've set. Now, the cool thing about the uh, chord track as well is that some people may not realize this, is that you can have it switched on on a track. You can record on that track, and then if you hit any uh, notes uh, that aren't in the scale, then it will correct that note and put it to the right part of the scale. I'm going to give you an example of that now, just to show you a cool trick you can do. So I've got this part here, I'm going to play it along, it's got this bass part which is in F sharp, D and A. So I've got the, got the, the scale that we go. There's your scale. So anything, if I, if I play a flat and stuff, and I don't want to play a flat, it will push it in. So I'll show you, I'll put it in record. So there I've done it, and, and there was some pretty ropey playing in there, and obviously that's not the take I'd, I'd, I'd ever keep, but, I, but have a listen to this now, warts and all. Now let's turn off the chord track and listen to it again. And you see straight away the notes are all over the place. Dear me, it's it's a pretty drastic mess. And as I say, I'd probably re-record that rather than to use chord track. But if there's the odd moment where there's a note out, you can just hit that and it will give you suggestions on the on the scale of the chord. And of course you can still go in, and I don't like this riff here, this still doesn't sound any good. I'd rather put that there, I think, on that sharp. So there we are, having your notes auto-corrected when you're playing by using the chord track as you record. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you again soon.